you know, most of the time, copperheads and other vipers are fed in kind of zoo idea. And, and I did this talk for IHS. And the idea there was, uh, does it have applications for captive management of, of, of copperheads or, or these, these, uh, these type snakes in captivity in, in the zoo sort of surrounding? It, and West, West, especially Transpicus coppers, are famous for not feeding in captivity. So what we're finding out is that if you try to just feed them a mouse, it may not be to their liking because their diet is a whole lot more varied. Um, when you introduce a caterpillar, in this case one that's uh, pupating, you get an immediate response. And what I was trying to do is get some decent pictures, but when they see and they key in on a caterpillar, the response is immediate. Uh, notice uh, there's two juveniles. This is a another type of caterpillar that's a pupating one from collected on the road I showed you the, the road there um, they lose their mind I, I would introduce and you can see in the one picture where the baby copperheads are up above there peeking peeking past that slice in the wood um, they would react very uh, positively at the introduction of caterpillars and some of them would get bit on the head and this is just a a quick sort of time lapse motion of a caterpillar being dropped into a cage, a neonate broadband that was born in captivity from a wild caught rabbit female, uh, naive, uh, new to captivity, probably only a couple of weeks after it's being born. You can see an immediate response that's a predatory strike. The snake will grab the caterpillar and the caterpillar will react. And this is a caterpillar that's fairly ornamented. A lot of those big green um, hornworms don't have a lot of hair on them, don't, don't have a lot of, some of them can be pretty spiky. Uh, this one had a lot of ornamentation and this copperhead you know, reacted very quickly and it's hard to get them to sort of slow down. You think that sometimes snakes will you know, feed and do it fairly slowly, but uh, it's very quick and, and they swallow them very quickly. It's, it's an amazing reaction. Here's a quick section of a, a copperhead sizing up a, a meal. And you can see how it's just absolutely sizing that food item up. And then they decide to feed. If that food item is too big, they won't take it. 